All right, good morning everybody. And um, yeah, it is January 31st, 2022. Um, I started my journey back in January, 2021, and I fell off the wagon. So I haven't exercised. Initially I lost, um, by going vegan, I had lost uh, around 10 kilo, uh, kilo, kilograms. Um, a little bit less, I think. It was more, closer to probably nine and a half kilograms. Um, a lot of that first initial weight loss was water loss, as it is with most weight loss. Um, I exercised. I was taking care of myself. And then, excuse my French, but shit hit the fan. Uh, Mia went back to live with her mum after being with us for five years and it hit me hard. Of course it would. I mean, I am human after all. I do have feelings. I'm, it's my granddaughter. I miss her. Her family misses her. And basically I struggled to um, keep motivated, to keep on track. I was still eating vegan, um, but then started to slip, started to get lazy, started to eat a lot of junk food, didn't care so much, didn't, you know, like I'm, yes, there's people out there doing vegan stuff for ethical reasons and all that sort of stuff. Mine was predominantly for health. I have high cholesterol. Um, although my cholesterol has gone down a bit, I did go to the doctors in the middle of the year and because I was eating good, it was still higher, but they didn't put me on medication. So you can see that update where I talked about that on the channel and all the rest of it. But, um, yeah, I have fallen off the, the, the wagon a little bit, uh, well, a lot with exercise, wasn't exercising at all, and basically wasn't watching what I was eating, eating a lot of junk food, eating a lot of vegan junk food, and towards the end of the year, close to Christmas of 2021, I just didn't care anymore. Um, I was struggling to keep my daughter on track and all that sort of stuff, <laughs> but anyway, um, I know I'm giggling and all the rest of it because people are looking at me really strange as I'm walking along talking to the camera. Um, it's early in the morning here. Anyway, I basically... Basically, I fell off the wagon and um, I tried to, you know, get back on it and all the rest of it. My husband really wasn't helping me very much because um, he's sort of, you know, in a bad place too with it all. And although we are getting better, like we are a lot better than what we were in the middle of the year, hence why there's been no videos or anything like that. I've still done stuff over on my other channel, my crafting channel and stuff like that. But you know, there's been big holes in the in where things weren't getting done. I haven't been in front of the camera. Um, I tried to keep as normal as possible and stuff like that, but I did really struggle quite a bit. Um, so fast forward, I was eating mostly vegetarian. Um, occasionally my husband would bring home um, my favorite food, which was, you know, Chinese and um, yeah, which was sweet and sour, uh, not sweet and sour, salt and pepper pork and um, sweet and sour chicken. And yeah, so he'd bring those home and I would eat them. They are my favorite meals. I, I love that sort of food. Um, spaghetti bolognese was another one that he was always getting me to make and that towards the end of the year so I did fall off the wagon anyway I have um, decided that I, I don't feel good when I'm eating that meat I have all sorts of issues and stuff like that a heartburn um, all that sort of stuff so um, in the last couple of weeks so I started at the beginning of January the last couple of weeks I've been trying to get my food back on track so predominantly I am eating vegan with the odd egg every now and again um, that is so I don't like I don't fall off my eating plan um, I've actually lost a kilo since the beginning of January and um, so today is the 31st of um, January and basically I am sorry I am doing an update to let you know where I'm at and I'm getting back on track so today uh, last week I had a friend text me every time she went for a walk to go for a walk and I've decided that I'm just gonna get up in the morning because it's very hot here in Queensland even on an overcast day um, and I'm going to go for a walk every day at least 30 minutes and um, I found a couple of fitness challenges to do and I 
am getting back to it so yes my channel is still called vegan made easy um but at the moment i am just vegetarian um so that means that i still have some animal products so i've i've still got like egg and um well pr pretty much only egg <laughs> in my diet at the moment so um i'm almost there i think by another week or so i will be back to predominantly vegan i mean it's pretty easy to eat vegan like especially if you like vegetables and stuff like that um so that's what i'm doing at the moment so i'm out for a walk today and um, i just thought i'd update you because i haven't done anything on the channel that's sort of what happened it thrown me through the loop and i am an emotional eater so yeah if I'm stressed, I don't tend to eat. If I'm emotional, I tend to eat a lot and a lot of crappy bad food. Um, so yeah, though like, I just thought I'd check in and let you know what's going on. And um, I'm going to do a couple of challenges and feel, film them. I found a, a exercise challenge. I'm going to give that a go. <laughs> this is probably going to kill me, but um, I'm not sure if I'm going to do it uh, this week. But I'm at least going to get out and walk every day. So far for the last two weeks, I have managed to walk. Um, sorry, I just realized there's a whole heap of bees right above my head. And um, yeah, so basically I have pretty much walked every day except for two days last week. Um, I walked three days a week before and I only walked two days the week before that. The first week of January, I didn't really walk anything. Um, I decided that I was going to get on top of my food so I spent that week um, cleaning out my cupboards and organizing everything and all that sort of stuff so I didn't film any of it I actually wasn't going to film um, but I actually had a couple of questions in the last couple of weeks asking how I was going um, from people I didn't even know so um, obviously had come across my channel so basically I decided that you know what I really need to get back into this so at this point in time I am 51 years old I weigh 84.7 kilos as of this morning i haven't taken my measurements um i will take them um tomorrow morning and um i will record them and then basically what will happen is i will just keep recording um things that i'm eating and all that sort of stuff you can follow me over on instagram under Diddy's vegan make it easy and then basically you can see what my progress is so January 31st here we go have a great day everybody and I'll talk to you I don't sound very motivated do I but it's because I'm struggling all right have a great day everybody and I will talk to you again soon bye for now